Several areas across our viewing area suffered storm damage in last night's storms, including some of the parks in our area. WBKO reporter Laura McCauley is live from Ephraim White Park, where crews with Warren County Parks and Rec are cleaning fallen trees and other debris in the park. Hey, Lauren. Yeah, hey Kelly. Well, if you take a look behind me, crews have just barely begun finishing up some uh, cleaning a large tree that was in the road when I was here earlier. Now, um, I spoke with Warren County Parks and Rec Director Chris Cummer, who says the park saw substantial dam damage, and the majority of which is trees like the one that you saw. Uh, there are also some damage to the athletic complex and battling cage area. Now, the park is closed today, so crews can continue cleaning up all the tree damage and everything else that was done uh, by these storms. And Cummer says they should be back open tomorrow on their regular schedule. And, and we just asked the public to be patient with us on the bigger uh, piles and, and the bigger pieces of debris. We're gonna try to get those cut up so that we have a better accessibility. Um, we will be stacking uh, wood and debris piles up along our trails and roadways. Uh, and then over the course of this week, we'll get all that moved out. And, and that way, hopefully by Friday, um, you'll be able to come to Ephraim White and Ed Spear and, and really not notice that we had the storm that we had last night. Now, again, the parks will remain closed today so crews can clean. And if you have any questions, you can call the office number at 270-842-5302. Closures and cancellations are also posted on the Warren County Parks and Rec Facebook and Instagram pages. Ed Spear Park is closed as well. Live in Bowling Green, Laura McCauley, WBKO News. Kelly.